I'm here with Chris and Malumu. Chris, obviously, uh, your first home game here and a loss against the Marines is unfortunate. How do you sort of feel the performance of the team and yourself? Yeah, obviously disappointed. You know, I think uh, I think we kind of wanted to set the tempo. We, we never did that first half. They got the goal uh, in front. Obviously, they've got a very good defensive record. But uh, second half, we kind of we huffed and puffed, you know. But we never kind of shown that quality in the in, in the final third to kind of penetrate them. But no, obviously there was a we, we had a few chances as well. Uh, as I say, we're not we weren't at the races, but we still created a few chances. So there is positives to, to take from the match. But like I say, I'm sure the gaffer will be working on the negatives uh, tomorrow, Monday, and we'll uh, we'll, we'll, we'll bounce back uh, on Tuesday night. Um, obviously after after half time we sort of attacked them a bit more do you think they just sort of sat back and uh, played for the win? Yeah well that's it you know I think they've got the goal so uh, they just kind of like I say defensively they're solid you know so it was down to us to kind of open them up we created a few chances so it was uh, disappointing you know obviously you just want one to kind of fall to you and you can put it away but uh, it wasn't to be today but like I say there's a lot of positives out of the match uh, and uh, like I say like the negatives will, will bounce back Tuesday and put them right uh, You've played a couple of games for Saints already this is your first home game um, the standard of the league, how do you think it's compared to obviously you playing down south? Yeah, well, it's a hard game, you know. It's uh, I thought I thought they they, sh they showed a lot of quality when we popped it around. We did, you know. So it's uh, no, it's it's like, like I say, I'm, I'm I'm buzzing to be here. Standards uh, good, and uh, you know what I mean. And, and enjoy my football. And uh, obviously, standards good. Uh, you're enjoying it, but how much uh, does the dressing room? sort of help it's obviously a very good dressing room including the Lumi song which uh, <laughs> I was saying about you No well to be fair like the, the the guys have been great you know from my first day in uh, being welcomed uh, and that, that's the way it is nowadays in football you know but like I say it's a, it, is a, it is one of the fantastic dressing rooms where uh, like obviously we're all disappointed today you know but uh, like I say I know tomorrow we'll, 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 we'll be in and there'll be high spirits and we'll be looking forward to the next game because we're all we all want to achieve something special here and we all want to kind of push forward and we're all on the same page and uh, yeah we'll We'll, uh, we'll, we'll definitely bounce back from this. And uh, obviously we've got a League Cup quarter final against Rafe Rovers. That'll be on TV. Uh, we lost in the semi-final against Aberdeen. Do we need to put that disappointment behind us and aim for another semi-final? Well, like I say, I just touched on that dressing room again. You know, like I say, we're, 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 a, we're a good bunch, great characters, strong characters, uh, mentally strong as well. And like I say, we want to win every match, no matter what competition. So that's, that's the way we'll look at it. We're on just the next game, which is Tuesday, uh, and then we'll focus at one game at a time. And uh, with the match being on TV, it's on Sky. Uh, does that affect your performance or? Not at all. Not at all. Like I say, you just uh, prepare for every match the same, TV or not, you know. And uh, yeah, as I say, we're, we're, we're all looking forward to the. It's a it's a tough uh, couple of weeks ahead of us now, and we're uh, we're, we're all looking forward to it. And uh, Gordon Strachan named a Scotland squad. Were there a couple of surprises in there for you, or just sort of the same? And did you think that anyone who wasn't included should have been? Well, like you say, it's it's a, it is a tricky one that. But uh, like I say, there's a few. Let's say players that are consistently scoring goals that you, you thought maybe get a little sniff here and there but I uh, say I'm sure I'm sure all these these uh, these opportunities will will, will come. Um, obviously Tommy Wright's manager here how does that compare to other managers you've had during your playing career? Yeah well I say the gaffer the gaffer I've uh, uh, has brought me in uh, and he's uh, he's one of the man managers you know he gets the best out of his players so I've had some good managers in my time Matt McCarthy Tony Pulis and it's uh, they, they know how to get the best out of the, the, the squads that they've got so like I say I'm just uh, delighted to be here enjoy my football and uh, and uh, hopefully I can uh, I can uh, uh, I say get some goals and uh, like I say we can move up the table Thanks a lot Chris that's great Cheers thank you